Well, it's official. I finally decided to keep my convention center and place it in my city. One of the biggest reasons I've decided to keep it is because I've got so much table space I'm trying to fill, and it's such a massive building, it'll take up this entire quadrant of my table, which is awesome. And it'll look great next to the Ghostbusters headquarters. Now, I still have a lot of work to do because the reality of it is I never honestly finished this building to begin with. One of the things I can point out is I never finished the stairway that enters the front facade of the building. And part of that was because I never actually had it physically placed anywhere specifically in my city. But now that I have this fully transplanted onto a mills plate, it's like, man, why didn't I do this sooner? Now, there's still things I have to do. For example, I still have to get the train track integrated into the back of the mills plate here. And that's why I stopped with the mills plate. And I still have to do some work on the pillars and such. Yeah, I have already started adding some lighting. And another thing that I'm looking at doing is I only have the one exterior light under here. So I'm looking at adding another one there, there, and there. Plus, I need to add at least one or two to the dock area because there, any loading dock would not be dark. One of the great things is, is because everybody that sent all the amazing builds that they sent throughout the years for my convention center is this thing is full. So you can take a peek in the windows and when you look in, you can see a full convention center with just builds everywhere. But enough with looking at this thing with the lights on. Let's turn the lights off. Now this is where the building really comes alive because I even have the stage set up with lights just to dancing around because I do have a band performing inside of there. And you can see the catwalk there. And again, you can look through the glass and you can see one entirely full convention center. Coming around to the back side of this building and it is a massive building to say the least. So it's rather hard to film, but again, it does need a few extra lights in my opinion. A few more lights is gonna make that loading dock look absolutely amazing. One thing that was really cool about redoing this build was quite simply being able to open the building up and access the inside and see all the things that I did when I originally built this four years ago. Hopefully the next time you guys see this thing, it's going to be placed into the city and I'll be doing a lot of the finishing work once it's placed. As I think this particular building here is going to add a lot of depth and character to my city. I know it's definitely going to help with the appearance of this particular angle, which is my absolute favorite angle when looking at my city. And if you like this video, click this playlist here to see more.